What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Omega Ruby walkthrough. Okay, so, uh, I kind of changed my mind a little because, uh, well, a lot of these things that I wanted to do, you kind of have to do it after you defeat the Elite Four, so, yeah, that is exactly what we're going to be doing. We're going to be going straight to Victory Road because, uh, well, it's a must. They really, 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 really put me in a, in a standstill right here, so... Before we do anything, I kind of want to check something out. Uh, I kind of feel as though a little something has been left behind for us. Let's see what it is. Nothing. Okay, so I thought wrong. Uh, yeah, I actually thought that we were going to get that Mitang or the Beldum before we get to the Pokemon League, but it seems that we need to beat the Elite Four in order to get the Mitang or Beldum or whatever. I don't even know. So let's go straight down and go to Evergrande City. Yeah, buddy. Evergrande City, where the dreams come true and all that stuff. Okay, so let's see. Um, we gotta get ourselves a repels. We bought ourselves a buttload of repels because, yeah, we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be going through a lot right here. Uh, as you guys probably already know, we've gone through this whole route right here, Route 127. Defeated most of the trainers. Uh, we can actually dive now, but we won't be doing that until later later on. Defeated most of the trainers, and, well, now we got to go straight... Actually, that's the wrong area right here. Now we've got to go straight down to Route 127, all the way right here to Route 128, in the area where we actually found Groudon, and this whole event started. And we're going to be going straight right here. A bunch of Pokemon trainers waiting for us right here. And, as you probably already noticed, yes, one of us, one of them has stopped us and everything. So, let's go right ahead and take on Tuber Dilmar. Dilmar. Of the ocean, I think I should know. I don't even know. And yes, I brought back Gaia the Fierce Knight because eh, we're going to be battling a lot of trainers. And Gaia is a fixture of our team. And... Oh, crud. Why did I use Thunder Wave? I don't know. But he can learn uh, Thunderbolt now since I actually found it and all that stuff. And, well... You can't move. So that actually works right there. So let's go with the psychic attack. Now, let's see. Off screen, I did try. I did try to go uh, to the Shoal Cave just for another uh, side quest episode. But yet again, it just you know it it just, it just won't let me. It won't. So that kind of sucks for me right there because yeah, you know I kind of want to get that done. You can actually do that before going to the Pokemon League, but. I guess there are specific times, specific times that we need to do, or, well, that we have to wait for in order to do that. And, god dang it. Yes, we're going to be battling a lot of trainers before we get to Evergrande City, which kind of bugs me because it's like, dude, I just want to get to Evergrande City, and it's probably on me for not battling these guys beforehand, so... It's yeah, it's a little bit of a little of something something right there. So let's go right ahead and use a shadow ball right here. Oh yes, Dark Kamehameha for the win. Suck it, Star Me. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Look at that. And Raiden grows to level 47. My Pokemon are doing pretty well right now. They're kicking butt, taking names, everything. Okay, so excuse me while I'm avoiding most of the Pokemon trainer trainer guys. I want to get to Evergrande City, want to go to the Victory Road. As you probably already noticed, look at that. Big ol' waterfall, trainers right there. I will be battling them off screen. The main thing is that we got to get to Evergrande City. And, uh, well, do our thing. As you can see, bam. Here, and, uh, yeah, look at that. Okay, so there is a Pokemon Center right here. And that's exactly what I'm going to do right now, is I'm actually going to just heal my Pokemon. Don't want to be messing with anybody right now. Now, there are a few things about Evergrande City or Victory Road that you need to know. And that is that you need a Pokemon with Strength. I believe a Pokemon with Flash, Surf, Waterfall, and Rock Smash. And I think I have, uh, I think I'm missing out on one of them. Probably. And you got to love the airplanes that are flying through here. So here we are, Victory Road. Oh, yes. Making this awesome right now. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Now, as you guys probably already know, our good old buddy Wally is already here. And we're going to be finding him eventually. It's just a matter of when. Now, like I said, you need a Pokemon with strength. And we do have that. Yes. Let's go, Main Ectric. 
strength your way through this whole area. Alrighty, look at that. And, well, there are some Pokemon here that you can actually find. Most of which I actually captured off screen, or have already captured. And, well, let's see. I'm actually going to go with Sage of the Halo right here. There are going to be quite a few trainers that you're going to be battling. It's going to be pretty tough Pokemon. Pokemon trainers. And, yeah, you, they're going to put you through the test right here. But they will get, you they, You will get an experience. Well, get a lot of experience points on this. And a lot of these Pokemon trainers do have some new Pokemon from other generations, such as Gigalith or Sigalith. And, well... My deal, my do, or my my duty right here is to beat every single one of them. And of course, X Sister doesn't really work on this guy since it is a flying type Pokemon. And ah, oh, crap! Gravity has intensified. Okay, Dual Chop for the win. There we go. Oh yes. Oh crap! This Pokemon is uh, not going out without a fight. And of course, he does have Air Slash. So that really messes me up. And, well, let's go with the Nature Power. See what Nature Power does. And it turns into Power Gem. And, yes, it works perfectly for this guy. Look at that. No more Sigalift. All right. All right. All right. And, of course, Nessie growing levels like crazy. And he's going to be coming out with a Rhyperior. So I'm going to stay put. Rhyperior, as many of you guys already know. The evolved form of Rhydon. This Pokemon is a tank of a Pokemon. So... Let's go with Leaf Blade. Look at that. And, oh crud, here comes a Stone Edge. And that almost takes me out. So let's go one more with the Leaf Blade right here. And just like that, Rhyperior has been defeated. My god, you are a tank of a Pokemon. And, of course, Nessie will be growing. I think it will be like at level 40 by the time we're done right here. We might even see it in a few battles. So, let's go right ahead and heal up our Pokemon. Again, make sure to bring a lot of healing items, guys, because, again, these trainers are pretty tough. Very, very, very tough. Anywho, as I'm doing this, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to you guys about a few things that, you know, have caught my attention as of late, you know. Little things, tidbits, and all that stuff, I know. Don't want to be, don't want to, uh, uh, uh whatchamacallit, uh, you know, steer away from the conversation or anything like that, but... Uh, let's see, we're still in a pandemic right here, guys. Uh, as many of you guys already know, I've made it an effort to get every single one of my walkthroughs out in a timely manner. I've been doing these in, a, in bulk. That's why some of you guys are like, you know, if some of you guys are wondering, well, he's already hit 7,000 subscribers or he's already done this. Why is he talking about that? It's because, you know, bulk. I've been doing this in bulk. I've, uh, I've you know, recorded these uh, ahead of time just so I can, you know, schedule these on specific days. That way you guys can watch and be entertained and all that stuff. That's my deal right there. Uh, any other walkthroughs that I'm planning? Of course, we're going to be doing Pokemon X, and I did mention that I will be doing it. Uh, I, I've already picked out the team. Believe it or not, I've only done five episodes on it. I haven't had the time to... You know, I haven't had the time to actually record anymore. Might re-record because there's been a, a few issues here and there. But, Pokemon X is the next walkthrough after Pokemon Black. And as many of you guys already saw, I've, I've already finished the first part of Pokemon Black. And we'll continue. Eh, yeah, we'll continue it. Uh, let's see. What is there some... Is there something about Pokemon Black that I'm going to be doing? Yes. Uh, the background to Pokemon Black after... Well going into this uh, second part of the, the game won't be on Pokemon Black, mainly because I kind of want to finish it. I think we're almost done with that, and I have started a production on, or recordings on the second part of Pokemon Black, so do expect that thing to happen. Uh, Pokemon Aura is right here, as you probably already know, we're close to being done with the main portion right here. It's just a matter of uh, getting everything uh, situated and, and recorded and all that stuff. Let's see. Hold on. I gotta find Flash. Okay. Okay, so let's see. I'm gonna teach this to Gaia right now. Uh, again, most of these attacks that I'm teaching Gaia, I can delete and, you know, bring back. I've already, I've already ha have it in my head that, you know, I'm gonna teach it Thunderbolt eventually after, you know, getting through this area right here. And look at that. 
And yeah, look at that. Okay, so uh, another thing that's been brought to my attention. Many of you guys, or some of you guys that, you know, are wondering, how come I don't have a background for this game right here? Well, it's very simple, guys. I had it in my head. I actually wanted to put a background for this just to showcase teams and all that stuff but the idea was do it and just uh you know well let's see how should i explain it with the backgrounds and all that stuff uh so i did have the idea to put a background for pokemon or as the only problem was i wanted to get this whole thing out and done as quickly as possible since you know we're in a pandemic and I don't know when we're when everything's gonna go back to, to normal if that's even going to be possible. And I was like, you know, after, like you know, I did make the background. I haven't showcased it or anything. I think I showed it on uh, on Instagram or something or Twitter or something. But after that, I, like after a few you know hours after creating it, I just thought against it because it was like, okay, that's just gonna prolong the speed of or the production speed. So I decided against it, especially for Pokemon Aura, since, you know, I will be having, you know, since it, it has been a good, a very good walkthrough for many of you guys. Now, the other thing, too, that I thought against it was the fact that, uh, you know, I, I have multiple Pokemon. I have showcased a lot of Pokemon onto this, onto this walkthrough. I've, I've shown you guys Pokemon from previous iterations and all that stuff, and... Yeah, I wasn't going to go through the whole, you know, transition thing of like, oh, look, in this episode I have Marsh Chop, or in this episode I have this, you know? I wasn't going to be doing that, so that's mainly the reason to why we don't have a background, right? And I do apologize if many of you guys wanted to see that. In this game right here, it wasn't going to be just one team. It's going to be a, yeah, it's going to be a whole plethora of Pokemon that I've used in the, the last few uh, walkthroughs that I've had. So... That's the that's that right there, and uh, let's see. Well, going with Pokemon right here, just battling everybody. And again, I do apologize if I've made this a uh, conversation of my life as of right now. <laughs> but uh, believe it or not, guys, it's been a while since I've actually voice recorded anything. Uh, this is actually the first time. It's actually June 29th. Yeah, month number three into this pandemic, and uh, well. You know, June 9th, uh, June 29th, the first time recording in like two weeks, and I just want, I just wanted you guys to be uh, up to date of what Draven's, uh, you know, activities are, what he's doing, how's he been feeling. I think in the last two episodes, I think I've told you that I may, like, I, I felt like I actually contracted the, the virus, but really it was just, uh, it was just Chipotle. Believe me, guys, you don't want to go through that with the whole Chipotle thing. And, uh, well... Not to joke around with all that stuff, but I do, I, I, I am in good spirits that things will, you know, eventually get better. It's just, this is a major virus. Many of you guys want to go back to normal. Some of you guys that don't like school want to go back to school just to see, just to see your old friends and all that stuff. Some of you guys are like, you know, this vacation is a little too long. This is the reason why we have school. But again, major virus, can't catch it. People are dying. Uh, since the nation has opened up, bam, you know, you guys already saw that, you know, we're spiking in, in cases. So it's going to be a while. And for me, you guys already know, uh, I'm a personal trainer. I am a football coach. Two big, like two major things that have been, I guess, paused and all that stuff. And, like, we're still open. Believe it or not, gyms are still open. They closed down bars, uh, like, a few days ago. Yeah, they closed down bars. Thankfully, I don't work in a bar. And my team, the staff that I'm uh, a part of, we're still waiting on whether or not we're going to start on time or later. My feeling is this. Uh, I kind of feel as though that we will be starting... Well, we're going to be starting a season pretty soon here, but the season will be paused midway because the numbers are so high and people are just getting infected left and right. So uh, that's my thoughts on that. And, uh, well, I'm only, you know, again, you got to keep optimistic with all the, with everything that's happening right now. That's why, you know, I haven't been afraid of a lot of things going on right now, like with everything that's going on in the world. Yeah, it's just, you know, you got to keep optimistic. You got to. 
you, you can't be super negative with everything that's been going on right here. And, well, there's another trainer right there. Look at that. Anywho, so enough about the virus. Now, I did comment, or I did post up on uh, my community board uh, a little something special for you guys. And that happens to be that I actually, like, I finally bought myself a Nintendo Switch. An early birthday present, by the way. Uh... And you guys probably already know, I got Pokemon Sword. That will be the walkthrough. The the next walkthrough after I get done with Sun and Moon and all that stuff. Uh, that will be one of the walkthroughs that I will be doing. Including Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and all that stuff. But it just it just depends on when we'll get this whole thing done. Because I've, you know, been doing so many walkthroughs. I know, many of you guys think that it's too much. But I've been getting them out on time. We'll see. We shall see, guys. As of right now, I'm just going to be studying the games, getting them done, trying to be the best. That way I can, you know, entertain you guys the best way I know how in those games right there. So, hooray for Pokemon uh, Sword, Sword and Shield. Hooray for Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee. And what else? What else? Oh, and hooray for my birthday. As I'm recording this, uh, next week will be my birthday, July 11th. Okay? Keep that in mind. July 11th, I always do something special. And on, on top of that, uh, well, it's the unofficial anniversary of the of Gym Leader Draven. Many of you guys already know I used to be Draven XC711. I switched up channels on my birthday a few years back. That got deleted. And I'm back here, which was Draven XC711, now Gym Leader Draven. So I'm kind of thinking that... On my birthday, I will be... I, I'm, I'm gonna try and do a marathon right here. Some kind of a marathon. Hell, I might even come out with the first five episodes of Pokemon X. Yeah, I might even do that. So, keep that in mind. It is on a Saturday, guys. So, keep, you know, just put that on your calendars. It might be a small marathon, because I always do something special for my birthday. And if you guys don't already know... <laughs> oh, man... How old am I going to be? I'm finally turning the big 3-0. That is right, guys. I'm finally turning 30 years old. Believe it or not, it's not that old. I still feel young. I still feel on top of the world and everything. I could still run, uh, run, uh, I could still run laps around many of you guys. So, yeah, 30 year old. So, yeah, comment down below. Old fart Draven finally turning 30 on July 11th. And look at that, kicking ass, ticking names. Just defeated the old thug right here. I said old. Gonna be like Joey from Friends. Why, God, why? <laughs> you made a promise. I might be like that. I don't know. We will find out. And it is dark in here. Okay. So let's go ahead and do that flashy thing again. So there we go. Flashy thing. Everybody's turned on. And boom. And let's see, anything else that has been on my mind as of lately? I know many of you guys just want to see the game and all that stuff, but let's see. I, I'm kind of limited on time right now because I have to go to work after this. So I just want to speak my mind just a little bit for you guys. Get you up to date and all that stuff. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah, something that has been, uh, that has caught my attention as of lately. Uh, the intros and outros to my videos. Now, it's going to sound like I'm being a, a, a dick, or it's going to sound like I'm being a prick or anything like that. Sorry for the cussing and all that stuff, too. But uh, if you knew me in real life, you guys already know that I don't, you know, I don't uh, cut corners. I, you know, I don't sugarcoat anything when it comes to speaking to someone. Uh, and, you know, this is one of those times where I'm just going to be like, I'm going I'm to be straight up with, with uh, what I'm going to say because... Yeah, that's who I am. So, the intros and outros to my videos. I get it. They're loud. I'm very, very sorry. I'm sorry, too. Some of those that, you know, it, it, it's hurt your ears or anything like that. Your eardrums and whatnot. Uh, but the thing is, I can't do anything about it anymore. Uh, these intros and outros that, that I'm talking about are mainly with uh, Pokemon. My first few Pokemon games, like Yellow, Crystal... Uh, Emerald. I get it, guys. It's a little too loud, uh, and, and I'm and I'm sorry, but I'm not going to go back onto my onto uh, YouTube editor and spend all day uh, fixing up 500 plus videos 
uh, just because, you know, a few, a few of you guys have been complaining about it. I get it. I know it sounds like I'm being a prick about it, but that's the truth, guys. I'm not going to spend a whole day just, you know, lowering the volume and everything. Especially with the new uh, videos that are coming out, I've already made the intros and outros to these videos and all that stuff. So I can't really change them. But I will consider... I will consider you guys' feelings, and I will consider you guys' opinions uh, coming uh, going forward with the next few walkthroughs that I will, I'll be, I will be coming out. I will be lowering those uh, volumes, but for right now, with these walkthroughs that I have, it, I'm sorry about that. Like, it, it is what it is. And, I mean, like, you know, like, you guys know who you are, okay? So, you know who you are who's been voicing the, your opinion about that. If you don't like what I just said, then you know what? There, there are there are other YouTubers that you know will like your subscribe your subscription. It doesn't really affect me because you know the thing like the thing is with this whole thing right here. I do this for the sheer pleasure of entertainment. Okay, I am not earning I am not earning X amount of money on YouTube or anything. If you guys want to know how much I'm earning, it's only 25 bucks. 25 bucks. That's it for the amount of subscribers that I have. Uh, so obviously I'm not doing this for money or anything. I'm just doing this to entertain you guys. This is a hobby. This is my way of getting out. And if if some of you guys don't really like what I say, such as you know like you know what I just said with my whole uh, intros and outros, then oh well, you know go find another YouTuber. Find another YouTuber. Uh, they'll be more than happy to to uh, to get your subscription. I'm more than uh, thankful for your subscription. But the thing is. I can't really, I can't really uh, please everybody. Can't please everybody in this whole world. That's one thing that you guys probably know. You can't please everybody. Some people will hate you. Some people will like you. It, you know, it is what it is. So, that's my take on that. Especially with the intros and outros. Again, an apology for blowing out your ear, uh, your eardrums and all that stuff. And it, it will be considered for the newer walkthroughs and all that stuff too. So that is that. And let's see, killing up my Pokemon since getting my butt kicked. And, well, bam, okay. So I think we're kind of halfway through this, probably. I don't even know. Uh, as you guys probably already noticed, I'm going through the whole victory road. Might be skipping a, f a few trainers here and there. And this part right here, we're outside of Evergrande City. And once you go right here, you'll actually find the TM29 Psychic. A very, very good move for, you know, any kind of Psychic type Pokemon. Or, you know, a little bit of a, what would you call it, uh, a little nugget right there for any Pokemon that you don't normally think would learn Psychic and all that stuff. <clears throat> like the Buzz, Magmar. And, let's see. Let's go with the Gaia right here. And let's go with the Flash. Okay. Let's see, is there any other thing that I, uh, uh, that's been uh, on my mind as of lately? Uh, let's see, the amount of walkthroughs that I've been doing? I think I've already covered that, you know, bulk taking advantage of this uh, this COVID-19 thing, even though, again, don't really like it. Uh, let's see, let's see. You know, it's been a while since I've actually uh, obtained, like, uh, since, we, well, I'm not going to say me. I'm going to include all of you guys right here, since we've actually made it to 7,000 subscribers, and we're right there. Like, I think by the time this video is up, it might be at 7,200. And, again, I'm thankful for all of you guys for subscribing, especially you newer subscribers. Uh, again, the end goal is to make it to 10k by the end of the year. I'm kind of having a, a like I'm kind of having high hopes for that one right there. But if we don't if we don't attain it, then that's fine. At least we've you know we've made we've made a major progress into this one right here. I mean, crud, 7,000 subscribers and we're still going. Again, thankful for many of you guys right here. Very, very happy, and I'm very glad to keep on uh, to entertain you guys in the best way I know how. Especially if, you know, there's a little bit of cuss words here and there. And there you go. What is this? And we found ourselves a TM35 Flamethrower. Another move that, yeah, will be beneficial for us. And, well, let's go with the repel. Yes, bring a lot of repels, guys, because there's a lot of stuff that you have to cover right here. And, crud, there's always a trainer right between me and the item. Okay, so let's go ahead and switch it out. Let's get Gaia to level 50 right here now. Uh, the team that I will be using going into the Pokemon League for the first time will probably consist of the Pokemon that I kind of started with here in this walkthrough. I know that I've been switching around left and right and all that stuff. 
but I think I have an idea of what Pokemon I want to use for the Pokemon League. And then when we get straight to the uh, the second portion of the of, of this story right here, the Delta series, I might change it up. Hell, I might even use a new team. Hell, I might even use one of my uh, I might even use the OG team from uh, Emerald version. That might be the case. Who knows? We will find out. And this guy is self-destructing. God, I hate you, Electrode. And that wasn't as strong as it was. But an easy victory for us right there. Look at that. Yeah, buddy. Nessie. Getting some uh, levels right there. Nope. Do not want to learn Parish Song because, uh, man, whatever. And coming out with a Swalot. This is easy prey for my uh, guy of the fierce net right here. And, well, let's go with the Psychic Attack. Okay, so another thing that's been on my mind, now that I've mentioned it, uh, Pokemon X. Now, I did say, uh, in Pokemon Crystal, I think? I don't know, probably. Liquid Crystal, I should say. Uh, that in this, in this Pokemon version, I will be choosing a team myself, especially the starter. And it's mainly because I've, you know, over the last few years, I've actually played this game multiple times. Almost to the point where, like, I, I can get this done in like two months, two months, guys. No, 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 uh, no lying right there. And if there was a preview to what the team will be, it's gonna be a, uh, I guess, a tribute to the six generations going into the 3DS. That means Kalo, uh, Kalos, Unova, what was it, uh, Sinnoh, Hoenn, Johto, and Kanto. So I'll have a Pokemon in each one of these uh, versions right here. And I'm getting a phone call. God dang it. Okay, so I'll be right with you guys. Oh my god. <laughs> I love people, believe it or not, guys. I am a very, very good person, and I love people. But sometimes they drive me crazy when they call me mid-recording. Especially my dad. Shout out to my dad, the badass dad. Anywho, as uh, like before I get into my little conversation, as you can see right here, we just battled Vito, the Winster family kid that is into the Pokemon League. Better than my family? Is that possible? Yes, it is. I just beat your family and I beat you, homeboy. Yeah, yeah. And uh, let's see. I was better than everyone in my family. I've never lost before. I've lost my confidence. Maybe I'll go home. Go home. Just go home. So, if you guys are wondering where uh, the last Winston family member is, it's right there. Yeah. Vito. Anywho, like I was saying, uh, Pokemon X. Yeah. Look at that full story. If that wasn't the conversation, I don't even know. I just forgot. So, yeah. Pokemon X, guys. Uh, I can't wait to come out with it. And, yeah. that You know, it, like, like I, I've said many times before, and I'll keep on saying it again. A lot of these walkthroughs that I've been doing... Or been redoing it. Uh, it's a redemption tour. Because July 11th, 2017... 2000, no, actually 2000... Yeah, 2017. Or was it... Two, no, it's 2018. Yeah, I'm tinkering right here, guys. Yeah, July 11th, 2018. That's when I made the switch in my Pokemon... Uh, in my Pokemon style. The name and everything. And it's just, you know... Yeah, it's just a redemption tour. It's just, a, I guess, a big old apology to many of you guys who have been subscribed uh, subscribed to me since 2010. And I've gotten uh, so many comments in my older videos about, like, man, your intros are this. Man, you, you, you go back and forth with many of your Pokemon, this, this, and that, and all that stuff. And... Believe it or not, it wasn't that I was getting sick and tired of l reading all those comments. It was more of the fact that I was like, man, like, they're right. I am going back and forth with a lot of my stuff that I've been doing here. And I don't have one specific style. I had like a whole plethora of styles that I was just BSing throughout, the, throughout my time here. Especially when I got uh, partnered with the TNG Network. That right there just made me just explode with many walkthroughs that I couldn't even complete. Mainly because I wanted to earn more money, which I wasn't earning. Now, with the new style right here, you guys have seen a very consistent amount of walkthroughs that I've been coming out. A, a, a good style of, you know, region per region per region. And because of this, uh, this uh, whatchamacallit, this pandemic, it's allowed me to record... 
pre-record many of these walkthrough uh, episodes and then just po po post them out there without you know worrying about oh did I miss out on a on a on a uh, episode? That was you know that right there has a, it has allowed me and that it, it's given me a good style, good reviews from many of you guys, which I again I thank uh, every single day. And with Pokemon X, while I was driving XC711, I did Pokemon X as the Japanese version. And right there, many of you guys did not like my Japanese version of uh, both X, uh, Omega Ruby, believe it or not. I did Omega Ruby uh, in Japanese. None of you guys did it, uh, liked it. And I I guess I quit it. Uh, I quit Omega Ruby when I was like, what, 30 episodes in? So look at that, Redemption Tour. It, like I've been you know making amends with all the stuff and again hope I'm hoping that many of you guys are entertained with all the videos right here I get that you know there there's a few hiccups along the way such as intros outros and all that stuff but you know I am making the effort for all of uh, the the wrongs that I did when I was uh, Draven XC711 like right now for Pokemon X yeah I will be you know it, it will be a it will be completed very very early and hopefully by the time my birthday comes around, I, I will showcase at least five episodes. That only depends if I complete either Liquid Crystal or shoot. Yeah, that depends if I if I complete Liquid Crystal on time because again, Liquid Crystal just a oh god, it's just a long walkthrough. Why did I choose to play it? It was because you know, never really did a hat game, so you know that, that that's on me. That's on me. But at least it's getting done. And god dang, this Musharna is always giving me issues right now. So let's go right ahead and use Crunch on this little bastard. There we go. And you know what? Let's go pick on this guy right here. Musharna getting bitten left and right. Look at that. That's one. Come on. God dang it. So yeah, guys. Pokemon X. Hopefully it will be success. And there goes Magnectric. God dang it. Hopefully it'll be a success. That way I can get that way I can get to the Sun and Moon games on time. And well, going on to that one, believe it or not, guys, I yeah, I've only played Pokemon Sun and Moon one time. Never played Sun and Ultra Sun or Ultra Moon, so I kinda gotta get I got I need to get on that before I even start playing again. There's a lot like I I kinda feel like these games are leaving me behind, mainly because, you know, I'm a I'm a hard working man in real life. God dang. And come on. God dang it. Hydra, you are really pissing me off. Here we go. Psychic attack. For the win. Yeah, buddy. Okay, so Hydra, come on. You gotta wake up, man. Wake up. And well, Musharna. It is a tank of a Pokemon, and it just nearly defeated my Hydra right here, so come on. Let's go with another crunch attack right here, and let's go with Shadow Ball since it is a Psychic type Pokemon. There we go. Yes, you snapped out of confusion, you a-hole Pokemon, you. There we go. Suck it, Musharna. Alrighty, so there goes that, and Nessie's growing levels. That's great. That is awesome. Alrighty. Okay, so let's see. I think we're getting towards the very end right here. Probably, I don't even know. So let's go right ahead and heal up our Pokemon because, wow, we, 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 yeah, they, there was quite a number on them. So Raiden gets some, uh, some loving right there. And, well, let's go with Max Potion onto Hydra 2. There we go. See, always bring some healing items right there. Okay, so here we go. Another one. And Raiden has been fully stocked. Okay, so. Let's move on right here, and yes, we got to use another repel because I I really don't feel like getting attacked by another Pokemon. And would you look at that? Okay, so it looks like to me that we're getting to towards the very end right here. And well, let's see. I have a feeling that we're gonna be seeing somebody right here. Somebody. I do love hearing my voice sometimes. People have said that I could be a TV announcer. I don't know. Alright, so here is the new area into the Victory Road, and I wonder... Oh, yeah, you can. You can uh, use Waterfall onto this one, I think. I love it how I say I think. Okay, here we go. Yes, Waterfall. There we go. Nessie, do your thing! 
And look at that. We will find an item right here. And it's the egg scissors attack, which, again, is a very powerful bug type move. And, well, let's see. Let's go right here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And, no, we can't go down there. Okay, so I was kind of thinking there was like a secret area right there. And, alrighty, so we're going to be moving on forward just a little bit more. And the end, the exit is right here. But before you do anything... Oh, damn. Lots of flowers. It's flowery. And, oh, damn. Would you look at that? Ah, uh, Draven! Sounds so homely. I bet you uh, must be surprised to see me in a place like this. That promise that we made back then? Thank, thank you for keeping uh, your end of it. It was actually all thanks to you that I could make it this far, Draven. It was only because I lost to you back then that I, could, I became even stronger. I'm sure that you and your Pokemon must have had to overcome a lot, too, to make it all this way here, right, Draven? Everyone's grown so much, and now we'll finally get to see what we all can do. Standing here facing you again gives me chills. Oh, damn. He's going Super Saiyan. But I won't give up. I won't lose anymore. My Pokemon have given me the courage and strength to fight. I have to win for their sake. So get ready. Here I come. Oh, damn. He's turning Super Saiyan Brawly. All right. Bring it on. Oh, damn. He's got... Oh, damn. Okay, so here we go. Our next battle against Wally. And, yes, he's coming out with an Altaria. Didn't really know he was coming out with that guy, but look at that. Battle of Roses. Good God. Alrighty, so let's go, Gaia. Let's get this. And, well, let's go with a Psychic Attack. For Psychic. For the win. And here comes that Safeguard. Of course, they like to defend themselves pretty quickly. So let's go. Let's see what magical... Oh, crap. Crap, I thought... Ah, damn it. Quick to the trigger. You see that? You see that? See what happened? You're a little fool. You're a little fool for that. And here comes an aerial ace attack. Not so powerful. So let's go, Shadow Ball for the win. It's not. It's that Pokemon's no longer a dragon or a normal type. And look at that. No more. Alrighty. So what you got? Magneton. Okay, I got a little Pokemon for you. It's been a while, but he's grown quite a few levels in here. That's right, Mount Vesuvius. Or Vesuvius for short. That's right, look at this tank of a Pokemon with two boobies on its back. It's a good Pokemon right here. Alright, time to eat this Lava Plume right here. And here comes a Tri-Attack. Oh, crud. And Lava Plume. Explosion for the win. Oh, yeah. And, ah, crud, it has Sturdy. Okay, alrighty. Strength Attack. And uh, here comes another try attack right here. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Here we go. Strength attack. Finish him. Alrighty. Magneton has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Look at that. Raiden kicking butt, taking names. And as he's growing to level 30, which is good. And yes, no safeguard for you. So he, he's going to be coming out with a Roselia. So I'm going to stay put right here with uh, Vesuvius. Alrighty. Let's do this. Lava Plume and Crud. Lava or Petal Blizzard. And. Ah, oh, Jesus. Defeated me. <sighs> okay. I can do this. I think I do have a Pokemon for you Sage of the Halo. Let's go. Sage of the Halo, I do have a move for you. Let's go, X Scissors. And, well, it, it worked, I guess. I, well, it is a poison-type Pokemon. I just realized that. And, well, he's going to be coming out with a Delcaddy. All right, I got a Pokemon for you, too. Uh, no, I don't. Actually, you know what? Let's stick with Sage of the Halo, because he's awesome like that. The reptilian Pokemon with a cool sword-like uh, tail. Let's go, Leaf Blade. Bam. Wally's got no chance. No chance whatsoever. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Look at that, and look at that. Okay, he's coming out with a Gallade. Alrighty. This is where it becomes interesting. I'm going to come out with Hydra 2. 
Alrighty. What's up? What's up? So here is a Hydra 2, and he's coming out with his Gallade right here. And as you guys already know, he does have that Mega Stone, and he does want to Mega Evolve this Pokemon right here. So let's do it. Mega Evolve. And Surf Attack. Surf and Surf Attack. That's right, I'm going to press that button. Digivolution. Here we go. Let's get it. And bam. That's right, the evil shrimp is about to attack this guy. And here comes the Mold Breaker. And Glade right here is using its Mega Pendant. Oh, damn. And bam. Flavio the Glade. Oh, man. Look at that. He looks so majestic just as a Mega Evolution. And look at this. Surf Attack for the win. Nope. And here comes that close combat. Probably won't work. Oh, shoot. Super effective, but it lowers its defense so badly. So that gives us a chance to do this. Surf Attack for the win. Say goodbye to Glade. Eat it. Look at that. Look at that. Hydra 2 undefeated. And Gaia, you know, learning experience points because of this. And Wally has been defeated. He's like, da -da -da. I've lost. And I've received a lot of money for this. Hell yeah! Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Da -da ha! Draven, you in your Pokemon, too. Thank you for not holding back when you battled against us. I was actually holding back, by the way. For not holding back when you beat us. Uh, and Glade, everyone, thank you so much. I feel like I've been able to take another step forward thanks to you. Oh, I know. I'll give you this to keep. I hope, uh, I hope it'll always remind you of our battle with me and with Glade and the rest of my team. And then, bam, we get ourselves a Dawnstone. So, yeah, I'm going to be getting myself my Gallade. What now? What now? If you have a male Curlia as one of your partners, Draven, I hope that you might uh, use that Dawnstone on it for me. I couldn't beat you this time, Draven. But I'll stay here to continue training. And one day, look out. I swear I'll catch up to you one day. When I do, promise we'll battle again. That's a promise I, keep, uh, I intend to live up to. Uh, okay, all right. He wants to smoke. You're going to get that smoke, homeboy. Alrighty, so that is that right there. And look at this, the exit. Fresh air. Yeah, buddy. We're in the Pokemon League. Finally made it. Yes, I'm happy. I thought that was going to take a little bit longer. More like an hour, but uh, no, we made it within 40, 45 minutes of this whole thing. Look at this place. It's a majestic place. And would you look at that? We found something very, very special. Ladies and gentlemen, look what we found. Mewtwo Knight Y. And believe it or not, guys, I do have a Mewtwo in the PC, so... Yeah. It's gonna be awesome. Okay. So, that is pretty much it for this episode, guys. Yes, it's been a long episode. Uh, I do apologize if, you know, part of it was me, you know, going on a rant or anything like that. Well, I didn't really feel like it was a rant, but it was just me... Talking about a few things here and there. Uh, again, for like the third, fourth time, I do apologize for the earbuds and all that stuff. It will get changed eventually. And I hope you guys are continuing to enjoy this whole walk right here. Believe it or not, guys, once my birthday comes by, it's going to be pretty special. I am happy that you guys are continuing to watch my episodes. Uh, I'm happy that, you know, I'm entertaining you guys. And hopefully... You know, I'm like many of you guys, I'm hoping this pandemic will end pretty soon here. That way we can go back to normal lives. Like normal, normal. And uh, yeah, best of wishes to every single one of you guys out there. Stay safe. Uh, stay clean. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode because we will be going through the Pokemon League in its entirety. So can't wait. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.